Hey y'all, I'm Tay Renee. Welcome and thanks for joining me. Today I'm giving y'all a little glimpse of Italy, a little sneak peek. We were robbed, y'all robbed. <laughs> These fools out here to stole lot. Yeah. Bon appetit, as they say, bon appetit. Bon appetit. A reach, a reba the dirt chin, a toilet, el toilet, bonjour, no chow. <laughs> you ain't got time, no, you ain't got to be having time. I you got it, I know, I know, I know, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Camera crew signing on each other. <laughs> All right, y'all. We got we couldn't find our um, hub, so we got to get a new one. Well, we couldn't find one hub. Yeah. But we got one, but we, I want to make sure we both got one. How much is this shit? Eighty-four dollars. See, I knew this was gonna be some bullshit. <laughs> Do we really? Can we wait till we get back home? <laughs> we really need it. We're gonna be there a whole week. Did I tell y'all that? <laughs> yeah, and then all our little day trips and stuff, you know, we're going to be out, out in the yeah. mountain, like, so. Mm, we just get what we I don't think we're going to be using our phone a lot, but, you know, we can use it to charge these and everything. Oh, yeah, we definitely need, I guess. We need it eventually. It's just that it's much more expensive in here. Yo, look who I spotted. Let me show y'all who I spotted. Y'all say. <laughs> y'all say y'all on your mouth like liquor. <laughs> like, like liquor, like, like, like liquor. I'm good, how are you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you Hollywood? Yes. Yeah, say, say hey. Okay. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Yo, it's hot as hell in here. <laughs> y'all, y'all hot? I'm hot. <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> I said no mushroom. <laughs> yeah, babe. I cannot wait for another one. Oh, Lord. Is that a mushroom? Did you know mushrooms be hard to tell? Yeah, those mushrooms are hard. Yeah, I know they definitely mushroom. I said it's that one one. And I said they're hard to tell. Mixed in with this stuff. Yeah, it is. Oh, oh my gosh. They should take definitely be taking something off. I got to sit here and pick through my stuff like this. If they don't take um, nothing off, no tip, babe. What I'm thinking. Well, the tip needs to reflect it. I don't know. I don't know. Take your time, okay? Excuse me. I didn't say no mushrooms. It was mushrooms. Yeah. How long will it take if they had to fix another one? Are you uh, allergic to it? Yeah, the one you can ask for some mushrooms. I can okay remake it if you want to. How long would it take them to remake it? Alone? Maybe like 10, 15 minutes. Depends on how much of the chicken they have in there. No, I'm I just. I can get a remake for you. I'm just going to pick them out. I will okay take care of you, okay? Okay, thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, is this is where we supposed to? Okay, thank you. All right, so it's going to be right here when we get off the thing, right? Yes, sir. Appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> 
Ocean Flight Deck, good afternoon, like to welcome you aboard 4781, service up to New York's JFK Airport, we are... Oh, we made it, we made it. Ciao, grazie, and arrivederci. <laughs> Waiting on our ride. I got mascara all underneath my eyes. My whole little size just sweated out, so I had to throw on my hat. And we gonna get right, we gonna get right. We're going to King Tut, y'all, walking around, seeing what he can see. Y'all, check this out. <laughs> bought me a skull. You know, you come to Italy. <laughs> <laughs> At the last minute. <laughs> I was like, oh, hold on, wait a minute. Gotta have a scarf in the bag. Y'all know I got a whole bunch of scarves. Y'all done seen all them dang scarves I got. Look, 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 look. Ciao, ciao. Okay. I'm waiting on my ride. <laughs> Buongiorno, Terrence. What's, I need to learn some things. <laughs> a guy uh, dropped his skull while we was walking out here, y'all. And I was talking English at first, speaking English. And I was like, uh, sir, whatever, something. He act like he ain't hear me. So then I was like, it's scoozy, it's scoozy. <laughs> 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 that fool turned around, didn't he? He gonna turn around and speak English. I'm like, well, you heard me the first time. I know. <laughs> like, you dropped your scarf. He's like, oh, thank you very much. <laughs> See what I'm saying? You playing, bro. You out here playing. Oh, gosh, y'all. <laughs> anyway, let me stop playing around. Anyway, we're waiting on our ride. we down to like a 30 minute wait, 40 minute wait. Nah, no, because they, they scratched out the 1120 and put 1130. Oh, you so know what? We're down to like 50 minutes. That's okay. <laughs> we in Italy. <laughs> it's all right. We're going to just roll with the flow. You got anything you want to say to the tippies? What's up? Before I sign off? Mm-mm. We'll holler y'all. We yep. got something going on. Yep, yep. When we got something going on. Excuse me. <laughs> all right, y'all. So... <laughs> We made it to our destination, <laughs> but we done had some problems, y'all. I'll tell y'all about it in a second. Just bear with me. <laughs> Just hold on. Enjoy the scenery right now. That's all I'm saying. So, uh, for 
whenever you guys want to go out and explore. No, oh, hold on. You want to put this in the car, right? Oh, yeah. Because you, you don't do. want to walk yeah. and carry that. So, just to let y'all know real quick, we got a friend here. Y'all didn't know that, huh? We got friends in high places. We got friends everywhere. <laughs> yeah, because you know, we was military, so. Anyway, so we staying at her spot. And that's where we at now. Y'all, look at this. Look just like off TV somewhere. <laughs> I know, who the fuck is Mopez at over there? You know what I'm telling you? Huh? Boy, I saw a guy if I see you on that fucking Mopez. Right there. You wanna see my black ass on that Mopez? I'm gonna kick you right off there. <laughs> I forgot what I was saying, y'all. It's a lot going on. Get your ass off of that. That's where we staying up there. That's funny. Well, look, when we went to the wire, I got it. Yeah, all the way at the top right there. Mopez. Or... Whatever they the second, them. third floor. But Chantel was so fun. That was her first time ever. I grew up right like that. Third right, three wheels, four wheels. She got on that. So damn scared because we ride like in the street streets, like yeah. in the in, like in the real road. Yeah. Chantel was so damn scared. I sure was. Me, <laughs> I was because like, I'm about to be in traffic that, on the highway look, for the first time in a moped like, in Hawaii. Like, I'll be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Chantel like. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm trying to go. <laughs> like, come on. That shit was so damn funny. No, that was like one of the funniest things ever to me <laughs> that we done ever been through, babe. Did you know that? <laughs> you on no, that fucking moped is one of the funniest things I ever seen in my life. Well, I'm glad I can uh, I can provide you with some uh, that moment, babe. Well, babe, you hold this and you gonna be in front, cause I don't want to just be getting. I'm just getting y'all's butt. Oh, you gonna walk behind me? I'm gonna walk behind you. Okay. Cool Let me beans. Put this down, I'm walking behind you too. So <laughs> <laughs> see the suckers, how their eyes looking. You know what I'm saying? They trying to grab that. Are you ready? Yeah. Punch a nigga in the throat. I know. I need you on my six, babe. So it's like for me when I again one of my other day anxiety riddle uh, times because a lot of the, uh, the alleyways look alike right so yeah just be careful or you can mark some shit i don't know oh, that was one of the things earlier i was gonna ask you how do you uh navigate what do you use like what app do you use to navigate yourself around here don't use google maps <laughs> um it just took me to get lost a bunch of times but google maps is i mean if i do if i'm leaving here I've used Google Maps, or when I rent a car, I'll okay. use whatever is on there. Um, okay. But Google Maps, that should get you lots of shit right. We were looking for a consignment store, and my mom was here. <laughs> we still looking for that shit. We walked around for like two hours. Somebody stole a lot of stuff, so this is why I'm looking ashy. <laughs> <laughs> you think it's going to hit him with somebody stole a lot of stuff? No, because you get me in some of these shots, and I'm still looking like Tuesday. It's Wednesday. And I have I have lotion. Somewhere. Yo, we done had two luggage bags stolen. So we got to go where we headed to tonight. We got to buy all our toiletries over again. Shoes. I will elaborate later. But that's why I'm still in my airport fit. 
Okay. But right now we hungry and we need to find something to eat. So I don't want to hit y'all on here talking no crap about how I look in Italy. Ain't nobody talking no mess, but you little know little lemon down. You know how Even though they don't wear that like the this athletic is, leisure is, wear like that. This is El Chapo. This is where normal oh, shop, okay. so they are closed. Okay. So we'll just circle around. Okay. My anti my anti theft bag got stolen. <laughs> <laughs> Both of them. <laughs> That's um, one of the Coliseum where they hold events. Yeah, that's a picture. What's the name? What's the name? Like somebody know. That's old girl. Nobody oh, know. girl, you know, you know, know she is. <laughs> Ciao. 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 Um, but this is like the hard stuff. Okay. Um, you can tell them what you want. Put this cognac in right here. Some new cognac we ain't tried. Boy, that thing said Jean Philolo. Lord. <laughs> so I don't know if y'all want to get anything now or, or whatever, but this is the next one. Get them cognac. Get them cognacs. So the rest is pretty much wine. There's some food as well. Hey, look, that goes the archer right there. Oh, look, stop! Get we that. gotta get that. You gotta get that. Look, this, 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 y'all want to get it now? That's the archer right there. This? You want that? Cause I gotta let you want to let them know. Oh, like I said, don't touch. I appreciate it. Don't touch. Sure I don't mean touching you. Well, see, I see some prices on here. What? What the prices go to? Uh, top one is 113. We definitely need to get that's our sign, Sagittarius. Let me get that on camera. Y'all want me to have him get you, get what? Well, ask well, them how, ask him how much you did yeah. for her. Yeah, that thing about four thousand. <laughs> I know they can leave that's the a, way That's a that. problem for me. <laughs> that's gonna be a problem, but that would be cool up in the king Yeah, that's cave. dope, right? Yes. Okay. Stop bumping me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Allora, the, eh, pr the price? Eh, lì, eh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Allora, questo è Sagittario. Allora, Sagittario. Questo 198 euro. Vedi, 198 euro. Vedi, Ariete, Togo, Generi, Cantro. Questo prezzo. We need that. We probably need to come back and get another one. Oh, how are we going to travel with that without it breaking? Let me get some britches first. No, I'm saying. I'm saying because I'm going to have my room. You're going to have one in the king cave. I mean, if y'all want to get some, I mean, because I do have another type of one. Yeah, because that's. Look, we going to have to carry that on the plane. Like, we ain't taking this. Yeah, baby, you didn't think about that. Um, that's okay. Wrap I it up. Wrap. I got Okay, good. Yeah. All right, y'all. See, hostess with the most. Y'all better get y'all one. Pack that <laughs> I don't know what y'all doing. Right. Do I know how to wrap it? No, but I got some. <laughs> Our hostess know how to bubble wrap. <laughs> ah, yes. Ah, yes. Yes. yes.
Yes, we're both Sagittarius. Oh, look at y'all doing it at your first night. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Yeah, wonderful story. I, I'm here all the time. I was just in here today getting them cases of wine. Uh, Terrence, if he don't uh, stop bumping me while I'm trying to film. <laughs> okay. Get your life. Oh. I know, you talking about bridges? No, I ain't gonna get it. I'm just saying. Oh, look, they, got, ah, they clean it for you. It's so nice. Oh, they gonna give you a little plaque or something to sit on? Yeah, it's a Sagittarius. Oh, snap. Hot fire. On some nappy hair. Hey. Girl. Do y'all have another one of those? Uh, do you have another one? Another? No. No. Oh, okay. Another type. Other quality, but this only this. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, I let you borrow it. Cheers. Whatever that is, ours. I don't know what you talking about. Gracie, thank you. Ciao, ciao. 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 At the red dough. <laughs> All right, y'all. We had to come back and drop off some stuff we just bought, but now we're in the complex of where we're staying at. So now I'm trying to give y'all a good view. So you pull in here. Well, you're coming through these doors over here. Here's everybody's garages over here on this side. Once you park, you can just park out here in the open as well, but it gets crowded. People do it anyway. Right now, we're lucky nobody's out here, but this is where you walk in. But they got these beautiful doors everywhere, of course all over Italy. So you can climb the steps or you can take the elevator. The elevator is tiny. I'll show y'all that later. Oh, here comes somebody. So y'all can see it in action. Somebody's coming. Tight fit, y'all. I'm not trying to be obvious reporting you. Look, look, 
like she just gonna park right over there on the side. So if somebody else come in, they just gonna have to go around her vehicle to get to the garage. This is tight, it's tight, y'all, it's tight. Oh, and there go King Tut. So King Tut, they took his all his clothes. The only clothes he got is the one on his the ones on his back. What are you wearing? Oh man. Oh. What's over that? Almost like I can't see. I got my glasses on. All right, y'all. So we're gonna do an outfit check real quick. My friend, y'all know we at her spot, and she got to look at this big ass mirror. Anyway, so I can finally do a proper outfit check. So the sweater I have on, that's King Tut's. <laughs> he got that from Stitch Fix. I'm wearing his clothes. And then the pants I have on, the pants are Hollister. I got from Hollister. And the shoes I have on, I have on my Hey Dudes. Hey dude, hey. And so this is my um, outfit for my first full day in Italy, y'all. And then my shades. I think I told y'all I had got these from Nordstrom, but I actually got these from Saks. So these are my shades. The shades I'm rocking today. These are the only shades I have because y'all know about our luggage. So. There you go. The other ones was they gone. Anyway, we about to head out into these streets. Give me y'all just one of the little balcony boot balcony views in her spot. And that's her dog Delta. Hey Delta. Walk out, this is what you see. Y'all know my babies, he just picked this outfit up last night. Mm -hmm. He had to make a quick stop because the poor baby's clothes is gone. And he got his little anti-theft bag on here. Y'all heard us talking about. All right, we about to hit these Italy streets, y'all. Take this spot out. So the shoes that I'm supposed to wear with most of my outfits I brought was in the bag that was stolen. So I need to look at some new shoes. I like these Tommy. Tommy heel figures. I don't know if people wear it no more, but you know, I don't care. I wear what I like. Since this was right here by the house, I'll, uh, yeah. if I don't see anything, I'll come back and get those. y'all we see this little spot right here we're gonna try it out you haven't ate yet today 
sandwich. This is right outside of the restaurant. So walking distance from where we're staying. This look like my spot I'm gonna come to every morning, y'all, and have my shake. <laughs> I'm gonna get, uh, I mean, not I'm gonna get, but I figure we'll have like a sandwich or something early. Oh, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah, we gotta keep an eye on my purse, so it's over here on the chair, y'all, tucked off with Terrence Tay, you know. And, um, that's why I had got the anti theft bag. So I can just be, you know. These vacations is not where you're supposed to be bringing all these designer bags and stuff like that. Just in case something like that do happen. Did I say good morning? Good morning and hey y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Lipstick on my teeth. I've been talking to these folks all it in these folks' what? face. It wasn't a lot like, <laughs> it, like how sometimes it be. It was just like a, it was like a, just a smidgy smidgy. But this is always what I fantasize when we go. Uh, when I think of Italy and being in Europe or overseas somewhere, just being able to sit outside. We got some stuff like that in the States, but this is Italy architecture yeah. and vibe and stuff. But when I look at my romantic movies and stuff like that, <laughs> I'd be like, yes, I want to wake up, walk around the block, come to my shake spot or whatever, my breakfast spot. Yeah. And, you know, sit out here and people watch and the nice and it's just... This is good for our soul, y'all, because of how the trip started off. But this is well worth everything. You want to go ahead and tell them your story? We got to tell it and get it out the way so we don't have to revisit it. <laughs> <laughs> they, they need the whole story of what happened. We just keep saying, got robbed. <laughs> <laughs> These fools out here and stole a lot. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Check it out. When we first got to the airport, Marco Polo Airport, we had booked a, a bus already to take us from Venice to Vicenza. The, um, well, first of all, the plane got there early. We got there like 45 minutes earlier than we were supposed to. We were supposed to get there at like um, 9.45, mm -hmm. and we ended up getting there at like 9 o'clock. Oh, hold on. People coming by. I mean, we were allowed. So the bus was supposed to pick us up at 11.10. So we're supposed to get there at 9.45, you know, go through customs, all that, get our bags, and the bus pick us up at 11.10. So we made it to the bus stop. We chilling, waiting. I get a message, say they're running behind. And then it's gonna be like 11.35. We like, oh, that ain't too bad. All right, cool. <laughs> 11.35 come, we ain't seen no bus. We're like, oh, hell. I look, I, they didn't send no message or nothing. I um, just happened to look on, you know, the website or whatever, because you can, like, you know, to give you the updates or whatever, mm -hmm. real-time updates and all that. So now it says, um, 12.08. So just to speed it up, so three alerts later. Yeah. Four alerts later. <laughs> yeah. So that happened a couple more times. Hey, y'all. So we had some technical difficulties, but here we go with the, uh, once the bus came, they scanned on our tickets, put our bags under the bus. Everybody put their bags under the bus and then got on the bus. Cool. Everything good. So apparently there was one stop, supposed to be one stop from Venice to Vicenza. And when we pulled up to this, to this bus, this bus stop, because remember we got picked up at the airport in the parking lot. So the only people that was out there was the people that's waiting on the bus. On they bus. Big buses. This ain't like the city bus or nothing. Mm -hmm. These are like, you know, like touring type buses. We riding through Venice and we pull up to like 
this spot in the middle of downtown just randomly and it's like 50 people outside apparently this is like a big bus stop i don't know they stopped the bus drivers got off they opened up the doors to under the bus where the where all the bags are i see them outside checking um people's tickets or whatever and scanning them in and they putting their bags under there for the people that's actually getting on so again it's like 50 people out there But there's not 50 people getting on the bus. Maybe 15 to 20 people actually got on the bus. But it's a lot of people out there. So anyway, Shantae was feeling a little nervous about the situation. She was like, you should go check on our bags. And I was like, you right, man. So I get off the bus. I had to fight to get off the bus because remember, they checking in people to get on the bus. So I had to fight the people to get off the bus. Everybody that was on the bus was just on the bus. Mm -hmm. Nobody else got off the bus to check their bags or nothing. I was the only person that got off to even check the bags. So I got off, looked under the bus, checked it out, made sure everything was good. All three of our bags are under there. I'm happy. Everything kosher. I stay out there for for a hot second, thinking we about to get ready to pull off because it's looking like they about to wrap things up. I get back on the bus and we didn't leave for about two to three more minutes from the time I got back on the bus. Everybody was on the bus. We get ready to take off. We ride for about 10 to 15 minutes and they make an announcement over the on the bus that we need to switch buses for whatever reason. So we pull up to their little station. Everybody gets off the bus, goes and gets, they pull the doors open for the bags. Everybody grabbing their bags and putting them on the new bus. That's when I found out uh, where the hell our bags at. Yep. There's two, it's three drivers out there at this point because of the, the guy that's taking the old bus that mm-hmm. we was on and then the new drivers that's on our bus. They sh- like, are you sure it's not this red one? I'm like, boy, <laughs> boy, stop it. So at that point, he like, look, we got to go. I don't know what to tell you about your bag, you know. Nothing we could do about it. We end up leaving. Now we headed to our destination. It's about an hour drive. And then we get to our destination, get off. The basically, you still like you got to contact the company or whatever and do the paperwork, fill out a bunch of stuff, and they give you some some money um, for the contents of, of your bag, basically. So that's where we at. So we haven't got the money yet, but we'll get the money or whatever. <coughs> and for now, I just got to buy new stuff. <coughs> so that's where we at, y'all. I know. Let's tell them some stuff we missing. All right, right off my jewelry. Well, first off, in Terrence's bag, his check bag, all his clothes, all his shoes for the trip, except for what he's wearing, of course. All our toiletries. <laughs> you know, deodorant, soap. Y'all know when I say toiletries, all of that. And then um, in my bag, my jewelry, which I don't bring a lot on vacation, but I already don't own a lot. So I just got a few of these. Excuse me. I just got a few of these bracelets that was in my carry-on. Um, a, a ring that go with this set right here that I normally wear on the knuckle up here on the same finger. The other earring. Cause I only put this one in because you know my hair is coming up this side, and then my silver, um, my white gold boots. So <coughs> now I only got one earring, but that's okay. <laughs> Luckily, I had worn this on the flight. Yeah. And um, my makeup. Luckily, I don't wear a lot of makeup. All I wear, y'all, is I do my eyebrows, some mascara, and my lipstick, lip gloss. <coughs> <coughs> what in the world is going on? And my blush. So I, we had to buy all that. Um, my outfit that I was going to wear home on the plane, which is my Lululemon. And y'all know how expensive Lululemon is. Uh, Lululemon at least I got the, the, and, like, the, jacket. the jacket. So at least though, that jacket, the, the Lululemon jacket that I wore on the way here, I had, I just recently got that like a couple of months ago. The That's jacket. Good. It is really good. The jacket that got stolen that was in my carry-on, I've had that since Alaska. Yeah. <laughs> so I got my money's worth out of that. Um, I had that for at least over 10 years. Mm-hmm. Um, what else was in that bag? Oh, my dang shoes. So the shoes that I'm supposed to wear like five out of the seven days we're here <laughs> that I just bought before we left here, y'all see them shoes because those shoes 
those shoes y'all see me purchase in another vlog so okay those shoes and then my Jack Roger flip flops y'all know me those my favorite flats my white ones those are gone and I'll, I can't even remember all my sunshades and my eyeglasses my contacts with my contact solution so it's just been a lot of stuff so I might just mention here and there throughout the trip like I bought this but that was that was the situation y'all or something like that but yesterday we went we got Terrence we got King Tut and outfit to wear for the day while we shop and get him some old clothes we got most of the toiletries yeah luckily we had a, a base you oh, know the yeah. bases here so we was able to go to the <clears throat> to the army base and go to the the PX and you know get all our toiletries and yeah there's an army base like not even 10 minutes from where we're staying so we got to go on there so of course they carry dove revlon all that you know stuff like that brands that we're familiar with so we got to pick up a few things still yeah. got my damn deodorant so i got to go <laughs> so <laughs> look y'all anyway i think the good thing we can take out of this is you know, it, it made us feel sick, of course. You know, somebody's stealing from you and all that, but we are in Italy. So the hell with all that. We've been running through affirmations out loud in our brain all day, making sure we stay on the right foot. Positive. Luckily, our relationship is good because some couples, that'll ruin the whole day trip. <laughs> Because they the tensions be high, they patience, all that other stuff. But you know, our communication and everything is They're doing a tour. Okay, there's a tour going on behind us. But anyway, y'all let me try this. What's this called again? What's going on with my throat? Is this the first time I'm trying to shut I don't say so. I've had, yeah, I don't remember. But this is the first time I'm trying bruschetta in Italy. Yeah. <laughs> Is it still focus on you or whatever? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The meat or something that's like was Yeah, that was that was that's it's delicious y'all, but something with the texture of the meat. Number nine and number ten. This is what we got, y'all. The you are here thing yet. Oh, okay. Like that they got this on the side of the street, y'all. Yeah. Oh, let's see what's up in this little nook over here. Oh, cool. Alright, so we're about to walk in there. Do this. Just a glimpse because we need to shop, it's our priority today. Man, ain't no shops in here. Come on, babe. <laughs> Get you some clouds. <laughs> yeah. Ciao. Ciao. Uh, green is about to be your new favorite color. <laughs> you got the shoes. Oh, here goes some pants. You see, you weren't that on vacations on the beach with your flip flops rolled up at the bottom. <laughs> I can wear that right now. Yeah. Are these the same? Same? No, this is um, like uh, jeans. Okay, because that's another I showed you the, a different. What size right. you have, babe? 52. Okay, uh, 52. This is 52, 52, 52. Let me look at the ladies' stuff. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. Okay. 
Now let me go back over here and see what Terrence. Babe, you want to let me see or you don't need me? I don't need you. Okay, I'm going to be on the other side looking at the lady stuff. Oh, my color. Okay, I'm going to try it on right here. Let me fix my camera. Me too. Oh, my head's too big. Oh, that would have been so cute. Do you have any other sizes? No, only one. My <laughs> head's too uh, big. Small. Yeah. Let me see. Let me see. No, it's the only Look, one size. <laughs> this is cute. My head's too big. Hair is too big. Yeah, my hair. Okay. It, would this material stretch a little bit the more you wear? Cut them. Cotton. A little bit, but not that like that. Yeah. All right, y'all. We got some stuff out of that spot. I'll show you what we got later. Now we're about to go and get us some treats at this spot right here. Go check it out. White chocolate. I don't know. I love some white chocolate. I had a few of them in the desert or whatever. You know, a lot overseas they use pistachios a lot. Yeah. So I, I think... had a few of different ones. Yeah. Alright. So that's what we're gonna get. Black bread. But anyway, I was gonna get that. A latte macchiato. Yeah. Mimosa. Okay. Prosecco. Prosecco, mimosa. Let me know. Okay, that's it. Perfect. And I'm gonna get a latte macchiato. Okay, latte macchiato. Mimosa, everything. Perfect. It's okay. Bye. All right, we're gonna sit outside, of course. Oh, right on time. Oh, yes. Okay. See. Grazie. 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 And then this is our view. Came with some compliment. This is complimentary because we didn't order that. Compliments of the barista. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, y'all. So here is what we are having for dinner tonight. Um, Sharice, can you please um, tell me what this stuff is? <laughs> Okay, for so the people in the back. Here we have the carne lasagna, so uh, the bolognese lasagna with meat. 
Okay. You got your cauliflower and broccoli out. Y'all know that. And then this is your branzino. This is your sea bass. All right, y'all. Mm -hmm. Bon appetit, as they say. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Arriba the dirt and a toilet. El toilet. Bonjour, no ciao. <laughs> that's all we know. That's all we. That's all we got right now. Buongiorno, buongiorno, ciao, ciao. And I just wanted to show y'all the name of this restaurant. If if you ever visit Vicenza, Italy, El Chapo. El Chapo, one of her favorite restaurants, y'all. So we didn't order it. They didn't deliver. Is that what we got? Um... Did, yes, we did. We walked in everywhere that we that looked interesting. Yeah. <laughs> like literally, we walked in like every fucking store for damn near. All right, y'all, outfit check. So this is our second full day. This is what I'm wearing today. This is what King Tut wearing today. <laughs> so shoes, hey dudes. Y'all seen these in one of my videos before. Comfortable to get around in and do some sightseeing. Terrence, are those hey, those not hey dudes? What are those? I don't remember. Okay, Terrence just bought them um, yesterday here in Italy. And then the pants I have on are Hollister. This sweater is from Express. I've had this for a few years. The pants are still available. I went online and checked. And I just purchased these pants like uh, two weeks ago. So, and they come in four different colors. And let's see, I said the shirt express and then the jacket, compliments of Italy. Picked this up yesterday. These pants are Carhartt from the PX. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> this jacket is from, I don't know what store was here in Italy. And this shirt is from uh, the PX also. Good day. Uh, and yeah, this is the look for the day, y'all. So we on our way to Venice, Italy. We're gonna go check the play. Um, we're gonna go hop on the train, but first we're gonna get something to eat. So let's go. All right, y'all. So we're back at our spot, same spot from yesterday. Just our go-to spot. We at the same table. We got a spot in Italy, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> we walked up here. I was like, ten years off. Ain't nobody in our spot. We got a spot." Here we are. Oh, thank you. To you. Okay. That's it. Y'all look at King Tut. Baby serious over here. Got his shades on and his reading glasses. <laughs> Looking cool as a fan, babe. <laughs> you look handsome. <laughs> Oh, that what you were doing? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to do that. Alright y'all, as y'all can see, we at the train station. So, we're in Vicenza. We're on our way to Venice. We're taking the train. They done put us on the slow train, y'all. I think it's because we were slow getting here. <laughs> so, this will be King Tut. First time on the train, y'all. Um, I don't think I told you told them this yet but um y'all this is my second time here my second time in Vicenza Italy and it'll be my second time in Venice Italy I was here like 20 years ago when I was in the military so I was deployed here for a little bit anyway I don't I remember a little bit of a little bit so it's nice to be back with my boot thing this time because he wasn't with me last time <laughs> he was overseas in I was in Saudi. He was in Saudi. I was in Riyadh, Saudi. So, let's go check out Venice. Oh, and do y'all know uh, we had to go to the restroom and we had to pay. So <laughs> I just want to let y'all know for y'all who visit. <laughs> Not in like the restaurants and stuff we went to yesterday, but here at the train station. The lady down there uh, ran. I'm exaggerating a little bit, but she did basically run tears down. Talking about something. <laughs> <laughs> we got pay. <laughs> we heard pay at the end. She was, she was looking a little gangster, wasn't she? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> she said buongiorno first. Yeah. <laughs> Look, uh, so anyway, that's the thing. All right, see y'all in Venice. I'll get some of this train footage for y'all. 
Oh, and I rode the train another time from, um, I can't remember if it was D.C. to Maryland to South Carolina. My daddy put me on the train to get to my first base when I first um, came in the military. I just can't remember where it went out of. <laughs> Y'all, we sitting right here. That was that stirred me. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I know. I'm like, Shh, am I too close? I mean, I know I'm not, but it felt like it. I felt like that thing was vibrating through me. <laughs>
that duck grease. Oh Lord. <laughs> Y'all hear him? He said that's that goose grease, duck grease. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, I'll probably get one more bite and that's it. You know how you got some of them things that, you know, it's not something you can eat a whole plate of. That's me right now, but Tam's Tut is over there going in. Get it, babe. All right, babe, what is this you got? It's so bright out here, y'all, so I hope I got the meal in the um, shot. It's a filet. It's a filet. Oh, it's a filet. Did I say it right? <laughs> yeah, that's what he said. On, <laughs> that's the way he said it. Oh, here go yours right here. I can't see. Okay, so what is it's a filet? Some type of fish or, uh, no, that's some meat. It's meat. You don't know what kind of meat it is? Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me tell y'all, my stuff ain't on the menu. <laughs> I just told them what I wanted, they can do it. I said I wanted some kind of pasta dish, noodles and shrimp. And it's not, you know, he just came up with something for himself. This is what we got. I'll let y'all know, I'll let y'all know. And Terrence is going to town on this, um, on this duck. <laughs> Gotta make it do what it do, baby. <laughs> Alright y'all, this is our first real gondola ride in Italy. We've been on the ones in Vegas. It's a morning. But that's close but no cigar. Is that how they say it? Mm -hmm. Close but no cigar? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean that was nice and all y'all. This right here. This right here is my <laughs> Pretty boy swag. Hey. <laughs> Look, they go, we got some company. We got some neighbors over here. Hey. Oh, it feels so good out here. It's the morning. In the moon. It's the sky. Like the feet. The beast of eyes. <laughs> 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 I had a little, little hood to it. <laughs> oh, you a man. <laughs> That's the remix. Uh, what's his na name? Um, Bajoni. Let me see if I see Bajoni over there. That was our wait waiter, y'all. Okay, so this is where we was eating at, where y'all seen us eating. Right here. Over there. Over there. Maybe we'll see him when we come back. I want to wait. That's the only person I know in Venice, y'all. Who? But Joni, there you go. Oh, yeah. There you go, He's going to come out all oh, late. Can't depend on nobody. <laughs>
Big Johnny. Big Johnny. He's trying to take order. He's trying to be. He's trying to be professional. Oh, he had to get on in. Yeah, man, people on the street. Yeah, I just do what I do, man. I want to yell so bad. It go. They say go red team. Celebrate. <laughs> 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 oh. Go green team. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. Glassy, glassy. Perfecto. <laughs> is, that, is, that, is that Italian? <laughs> Check him out on Instagram, y'all. Terrence, he, he, he'll fire, Terrence will fire him a Red Bull, y'all. Look, look. <laughs> I know, I'm ridiculous. We done found a couple of spots. <laughs> Excuse me. We done found a couple of spots in Vicenza. That say, oh, y'all know the spots we were talking about? The, where we go get our shakes in the morning. And you know we got a pastry spot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got a pastry spot. We got a coffee spot. We got a, a shake spot. So look, those spots sell his Red Bulls. I noticed today. And he noticed the other one the other day. I was like, oh, snap. Now we in here. He done found some Red Bulls. You don't have to zoom in. You could have stayed over there. I just wanted to wave Ciao. in the background. Ciao. Arrivederci. <laughs> <laughs> I just been cool, man. Gracias. Prego, signore. All right, so we just ordered us some mojitos. Cheers. And this is our last toast and drink to, oh, babe, we're supposed to be looking at each other in the house. Love you. Love you. So. Smooches. Yeah, we just, we about to leave and catch this train back. Make sure we get home. And uh, we just toasting, having one drink here. Because we ain't getting nothing to drink for our uh, lunch. So yeah, that's all we doing, y'all. See y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, so this is about to be real quick because we're rushing. We're going to Murano, Italy, Italy today. So we're rushing. We hardly had no sleep last night. We had to hurry up and get up. So I'm just going to show y'all real quick uh, what I'm wearing. So y'all know I lost my shoes. Not lost. I keep saying lost. We were robbed, y'all robbed. So the shoes that I got to wear with these, uh, they're gone. So today I'm going to look for some new shoes, but this is the outfit. I have on linen pants again. I have bought four pair of these with me here because I feel like it's a very Italy. And today they're white. And again, I got these from Hollister. And this sweatshirt here, black and white, got the little elbow patches, brown elbow patches um, on the, you know, elbow elbows, of course. And, um, you know, it's cold, so... This is what the fit is looking like today. And then, oh, King Tut enters the room. Oh, I don't got my shades on. So this is what King Tut is wearing. His Italy outfit, because you know, his, his whole, whole wardrobe gone. So this is the new wardrobe that he picked up. 
What was that yesterday, day before yesterday? He looking cute, babe. So he got his white top on to match, you know, so we can look like we coordinating. Okay. But anyway, do y'all think this is very, says Italy, in the, you know, cold weather Italy. So this is the fit for today. I got the little <laughs> I ain't getting nothing. I think I got the little thing. The thing was going on crazy. What? The stabilizer. You ain't got time. No, you ain't got to be having time. I got it. I know. I know. I know. Okay, okay, okay. The camera crew signing on each other. <laughs> Hours on it, like some of the other ones. It was, yeah. it's a lot, uh, yeah. it's like a ranch, it's like yeah. a ranch style. Yeah. That's probably gonna be the one I got the best shot out of. Yeah. It seemed like it was in the perfect position at the perfect time, you know. Be right back. Okay. Oh, this looks nice, y'all. Just gonna be shaking because the stabilizer, you know. Thank you, darling. All right, y'all. So we made it to Morona. Let me show y'all the spot. Okay, this you. This is what you get. This is what we got. Our balcony. It's a wraparound balcony. So we got a view. This is our view. Oh look, baby, wraps around. I didn't think it 
I wasn't expect, expecting the balcony to be this big. Me either. What we see from our balcony, y'all. We got the mountains right here. Yeah, this is right off in the mix. Yeah, right downtown. Is this downtown Morona? And then the balcony also wraps like around to the other side as well. Yeah. And this is the view from the right side of the balcony. More mountains and then downtown. So let's see, they got a little table out here for you. You can eat out here. Chill out here. Some lounge chairs over here we can set out. Uh, we got people down there chilling. Oh, the bathroom. <laughs> okay. Let's see what the bathroom looks like. There's our hotel right there, so you can see how close, how close it is to downtown. Like we right here. All right, y'all, we about to hit downtown and get something to eat. y'all this is where we were gonna try to eat at but they closed this is where our friend ate that the last time and recommended but they're not open what you say all right y'all so this is where we decided to eat at let's go check it out You can sit outside in the front, right there. Or you can sit inside, or you can sit outside in the back. And that's where we're gonna sit at. Right up in here. This is the Force Beer restaurant. This is what this place is going for. This is that brewery I was talking about that's somewhere in the castle can't nobody find. Oh, yo, these are delicious. Some kind of chip. What is it? Potato, yeah, potato. yeah, yeah, y'all. We forgot what some, some of this stuff was called, but it's delicious. I was about to say potato crisp, but I know that's wrong. This is a bacon, <laughs> bacon dumpling, sauerkraut, potato sausage, horseradish, ribs, bread. What's this? Turkey? Pork knuckle. Pork, pork, oh yeah, pork knuckle. This is everything seasoned up very well, and it's delicious, y'all. It's delicious. It's delicious. <laughs>
Today is May 1st, it's Monday, our last day. So far it's been the coldest day and it's windy and it's supposed to rain. But anyway, so this is what I'm wearing today. Outfit check, camouflage, fatigue pants. Got these from Hollister. And then I have on the Hey Dudes, the only pair of shoes I have right now. I have on this green sweater. Got this from Express years ago. And then this I got here from Italy. So that is the outfit check for the day. What y'all wearing? <laughs> and here we I'm go. I'm you about those other shoes. Oh yeah, I found some um, the shoes I had on yesterday, which I didn't have time to get on here and record everything yesterday. When we was in Morona, Italy. But anyway, when Murano, when we was in Murano, Italy yesterday, they had an H and M and Zara. Which one I get that from? H and M, and it was only like nineteen ninety nine. So I picked those up real quick because uh, I needed something to wear with the outfit that I wore yesterday. The shoes I was supposed to wear with that was in the luggage that got stolen. Okay, here's King Tut and what he's what he has on today. Looking fresh. Yeah. Fresh to death. Ooh, kill. Ooh, kill. Mm -mm. All right, we're about to hit these streets. <laughs> Look, y'all, we at our spot and somebody got our seats. We <laughs> stole our seats. <laughs> we didn't get here soon enough. Right there to the left, y'all. Right there, right there. Straight ahead. Those are the culprits. <laughs> <laughs> Alright y'all, y'all want me to tell y'all some um, what I've learned so far in Italian? You may or may already know. <laughs> so, okay, what we got? We got um, grazie, grazie, that's thank you. And then we got grazie mille, that's thank you very much. And we got child, child, that's hey and bye. What else, man? Frigo. Frigo. Yes, you're welcome. Yeah. Um, Arrivederci. Arrivederci. <laughs> That's. <laughs> I'm being silly. I'm just silly. I'm silly somebody. Um. That's goodbye. What else, babe? I know we got something else. Um. Salute. Like cheers. Oh, salute. Cheers. Whatever. Well, once we, we working on ourselves. <laughs> we trying over here. We trying. We had learned something I forgot already, like, instead of just saying, um, when they're speaking to you. Okay. All right, grazie. To you. And to you. Grazie. Um, what tips we got for them for when they come here? Mm. All right, so when y'all come to Vicenza, I suggest staying over here on somewhere very close by on the Palladio. That's the right way. I said that the right way, right? The Palladio. It's everything, y'all. So, like, where we're staying, we're just like a two-minute walk from here, and all the shops and um, restaurants and things like that. And, um, it's just a nice little, it's a nice little area. Convenience store. Like, if I lived here, this is where I would want to live. I can just wake up in the morning, come down here, grab what I need to eat, go shopping, all that. It's a nice vibe. It's a relaxing vacation. Relaxation, peaceful, 
you know, absorbing the Italy vibe. Yeah. Some good shopping. Yeah, and it's not crazy like here, like in Venice and mm -hmm. Rome and just mm -hmm. a crazy amount of tourists and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. It's got a nice, a nice crowd without being overwhelming. Right. So we we were thinking about heading out into more of Vicenza, but we probably just gonna relax and eat good for the rest of the day and do some window shopping. I'll see if I can find some eye candy for y'all. Any train advice when they taking the train? She said, um, what? I asked if you had any train advice for when you're taking the train. Um, nah, if you just, you just have to know exactly where you're going. Mm-hmm. And I forgot what the, um, what the word for arrivals and the word for departure is. I know oh, what I'm yeah. saying now, but yeah. if you know those words, you know what to look for for the arrivals when when the train's gonna show up and you know what to look for for um, the departure. departures departure or something like with a p like oh whatever we'll no, show y'all with a t time. i think but we'll show y'all when we get to the train station because that's how we get to the airport oh yeah just knowing really where you're going like if you're going from here to like venice it's not it's not gonna say the train's not gonna say venice on it it's gonna say Venenza, Venezia. And yeah, Venezia. Um Mestre is for like the main the mainland for Venice. And then um Venezia, um what was it? Saint Lucia, Saint Lucia, Venezia Saint Lucia for the like the downtown, like the the alleys, the waterways and stuff like that. Where everybody go to that's called Venezia St. Lucia so you have to know exactly where you're going because you think so we was kept looking for Venice but that's not how it's gonna show up on the joint mm -hmm. <laughs> it's Venezia so peace out food all right so let me tell y'all what we did last night why y'all didn't see me yesterday <laughs> so after we got back from Morano we um we came back and we did we um had a little faux pas because we got american food and you know we try not to do that when we um in another country <laughs> yeah, we had to do that. yeah so <laughs> you know they got the army base like down the street uh about 10 minutes away i guess and um on there they got popeyes they got subway they got uh, taco bell <laughs> What else? Burger King and some other things. So they got some Taco Bell, I got some Popeyes, and we came home and we was tired, y'all. We tired. And oh, well, too, not just that, but most of the restaurants closed. Yeah, on Sunday, Sunday. Uh, the, another, the main reason why we did that, though, because yes, they shut down stuff on Sunday here. So um, most of the stuff. Anyway, so yeah, we did that, got back to the spot, and we binge watched some screen. We watched, we wanted to watch the new one, so we went back and watched the, 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 the one before that, and then the next one. And then we just had some drinks, y'all. We got some drinks on base, and had some drinks, and just relaxed, and was talking most of the damn night, and just relaxing. So. That's why y'all didn't see too much. Plus, I was tapped out, y'all. I was tapped out of recording everything. Recording <laughs> and just tired from all the walking. Yeah, it's a lot of walking we've been doing. And today, I think what we're gonna do all along the Flavia is kind of restaurant hop. You know, people be bar hopping, so I was like, what we, what we can do, babe? It's restaurant hop, so we can go and probably get an appetizer or just one meal and share it and just kind of taste test each pot, get one little thing. And so y'all can get an idea when y'all come what the food looking like and tasting like. Yeah. <coughs> you know we're going to tap out early. Yeah, we're going to tap out early because we got to get up early and catch the plane. No, I mean I'm the train. About the food. You know, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Even if we get a little appetizer, we don't be like, hey, I'm full already. Uh huh. <laughs> well, all we gotta do is get out here and walk for a good enough yeah. 30 minutes and then we we'll be ready to snack on something. Yeah. yeah.
we'll, we'll be working it all. Oh, and today is their Labor Day, just so y'all know. So, yeah. Be shut down early. yeah. And stuff normally shut down. Y'all probably may already know this stuff be, they shut down and take naps and stuff like that. So that's been something we have to remember and get around and try to get out here before they shut down and get out here when they open. Because they don't be working their folks to death over here like they do where we at. Yeah. So, what's that? Somewhere between 11 to 12 to about um, 4, 3 or 4? No, it's, it's like it's after lunch. So like 2 to like 4 or 5. Okay, so like and then two. they open back up at like six or seven for like dinner and stuff. Okay, like y'all hear that? After lunch, and then so about two, and then they open back up about five, six, seven. It's really, whatever they feel like. Really. Yeah, yeah. Whenever they get tired, they shut it down. Yeah. Yeah, cause we done went to a couple of spots. We're like, dang, they early. Yeah. Oh, where they at? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, in the dress over here. I guess I could tell y'all about the attire over here. So, before we came over here, what we were reading was stay away from flip-flops. Um, it could be like some some casual or dressed up flip-flops or um, sandals, flat sandals, flats. Um, because of the roads over here, the amount of walking, stuff like that. But they really are not... They don't do flip flops really. I think I seen one girl wear flip flops. Yeah, I didn't see it. I seen it when we was walking to the train station. Yeah. I seen one girl wearing flip flops. We saw that they said they really don't do jeans over here. Well, I saw that, but I see jeans over here. <laughs> you they walk around here in leggings and stuff, y'all. So that's why I didn't want to pack nothing like that. Um, they wear that stuff for to go to the gym and get back. <laughs> and they change it. Oh, uh, what else? What else? So yeah, you see a lot of um chic, chic style. And... Yeah. But for the jeans and stuff, that's like casually throughout the day, but at nighttime for like dinner. Oh yeah, you, you know, ain't gonna see, they, yeah. That's when they, that's when they put their school clothes on, mm -hmm. the church clothes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they dress up for dinner and whatnot. And y'all been seeing throughout the footage throughout this video or whatever hopefully y'all I got enough of people walking by and stuff so y'all can see that's why I've been doing it so y'all will know how to uh, what type of wardrobe y'all want to pack when y'all come um, I don't see no overweight people really I don't think I seen anybody overweight. maybe one one when we was walking here one big girl but um, yeah really you don't and I'm just, you know, it's a lot of bicycles and walking and stuff like that. And of course, the food is extra, extra healthy over here. They don't have all that crap. We got no foods. Yeah. So all organic stuff, majority, I'll say majority organic stuff. Even their sodas have stuff different, ingredients and stuff like that. So it ain't going to taste like our soda. Because they ain't for the bull crap, y'all. Yeah. All I know is I love it. Anywho, ciao. Ciao, <laughs> Right, darling. All right, y'all. This is Seppo. Excuse me. All right, this is our first little restaurant. Huh? Did I see my shrimp bed over here? This look like that might be good. Ribs. Look, this right here look like it might be good. I don't know what that is. See, right there. Over here? Yeah. It says baked boneless rabbit. Oh, right, yeah, let's try some rabbit. <laughs> Meatballs, babe. I know. You want to try one of those? Some Italian meatballs. You want some to take away? Yes. Yeah. Um, you want to try the the rabbit, the big yeah. rabbit? Just one piece I'm going to share since we rest. Yeah, just a little, little, right. little, little bit. And, and, then, and mashed potatoes. Well, then, um, just a small order of the shrimp over there. Looks like in here. More portion of the. Uh, yes, okay. yes, please.
All right, y'all, we decided to try out this spot right here. Let's see. Garibaldi. <laughs> Garibaldi. We think that's how you say that. We don't know. We plan sure on. Don't. We, just, <laughs> hey, we just making it do what we do, man. Garibaldi. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, so she just the waitress just came over here and she said they have English menu. Oh, menu oh grazie. Grazie. So I was like, oh yeah, so she, you know, she's like, you want English menu? Not many restaurants had that option, y'all. That's why I'm excited, okay? So we can really <laughs> see what's going on here. Got a little bit of everything. This might be the spot right here, y'all. They got a little bit of everything. Let's see. Hold on. Look, we came just in the nigga time too, cause look, lunch is from. They probably shut it down from, so they shut it down from all the way from three to eleven. They got um, fajitas. They got fettuccine, shrimp, mashed potatoes, bagoli. This on y'all itinerary if y'all come here. Well, we'll we'll let you know how the type tastes. I won't know after this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Start to figure out what this tartar is. We keep seeing it. It's raw ground beef. Oh, no, we don't want that. Tartar is raw ground beef, y'all. They got this radicchio. Yeah, they call it raw, raw, raw ground beef steak or raw ground beef filet. Okay. I know. We already got lunch left over. Yeah. This might be the last stuff we just bought. This, I know. This might be the last stop on the bar high. <laughs> We're going to try out the galato. What's that no? Yeah, I see that right. The gelatos. Cause Gelato. We, gelatos, because we heard a lot about that online, so we gotta try try it out here. Try it out here in Italy. See what all the hype is about. Alright y'all, we ordered the meatballs and the fajitas. We're in Italy, we gotta try Italian meatballs. <laughs> Oh, it just started raining. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They got Nan umbrella. <laughs> Not Nary. <laughs> look, look, look. She just rolled by. Now she rolled back in the opposite direction. She's like, I got to get the hell out of here, Nan. <laughs> <laughs> Don't play with this rain. See some people like 50-50, half of y'all liking it, half of y'all like mm. <laughs> mm, smells delicious, babe. This sauce look like it's gonna be mm. Tell y'all, these day, um, these day fajitas is off the chain. They are so, so, so delicious. I want to say it's the best thing, flavor, and just the best tasting thing I've had so far here in a meal. And now here go the meatballs. We're about to try that. See how that go. But y'all, yes, those fajitas. Mmm. The combination of everything they had in there, that cheese, that meat, the seasoning, it was so delicious. Now let's try these Italian meatballs. We're going to order some more meatballs. Another time fajita. 
And I just tasted the drink. It's the restaurant signature drink. How you say this? How you say the name of this drink? Garibaldi, Gar yeah. something like that. Anyway, it reminds me kind of like a flavor mojito a little bit. Yeah, it's the name of the restaurant. Yeah, that's what I just said. And she said Jeff. What I Jeff. Heard. Jeff. Okay, so that was delicious, refreshing. Good. Am I gonna like it? Yeah, you gonna like it. Oh snap! I forgot the name of this. <laughs> Motto, man. No, oh. the flavor. Del <laughs> uh, Mundo. Mmm. Ooh. <laughs> this is delicious. Right one. And I seen that that caramel and chocolate swirl and stuff up in there. Yeah. Look at you. This is one of the best I've had. <laughs> You got it. Oh, that was you. Oh, I got you. Don't you worry. Oh, huh? Terrence. I'm here in front of all these folks talking dirty. <laughs> Wait till we get to that cone. I sure don't remember trying it and being that good. Like, I ain't gonna forget this. <laughs> oh, that's what you want to do, eh? Let's get on back to the crib. That's what you want. <laughs> mm, look at that. Look at that. That's all my part. Oh, yeah. Hey, baby, work it out. <laughs> if I had this in a brownie, hot fire. You want to know what to do with yourself, do you? I sure would. All right, y'all, we headed back home. We got a pack. We're gonna try out this food that we picked up earlier from the other spot. Y'all seen us pick up Seppo's and uh, Seppo. I can't remember. Anyway, the name of that spot, we picked up food from there. We'll try that out tonight. Show y'all, let y'all know if it's, that's somewhere y'all need to hit up. That's the spot with the mashed potatoes and the rabbit. We're about to eat some rabbit. One place we wanted to try while we was here that's right around the corner from where we're staying. They got all the tables and stuff up now. It's this spot right here. Oh, I don't even know how to pronounce the name of that one. But anyway, normally when it's open, it's crowded. I think they probably just open up for dinner. Mm, okay. But yeah, go ahead on back home, pack. Because we got to get up very, 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 very early. I'm about to show y'all how the elevator work in this building. The old school elevator. You gotta put your key in there. Well, if y'all didn't see the key, we had to put the key in there. Open up the door. Open up these two doors. It's tiny in here, y'all. It's tight. Fit three people in here tightly. If y'all ain't got nothing but a purse, <laughs> don't be trying to get in here with a bunch of bags and things. <laughs> oh, let me see. Let me show them. Okay. That's good enough, y'all get it. Hope y'all can tell. 
how small it is. All right, we home. Oh, sweet home, trying to pack. Oh, I think she got the, she keep the watch on her. Oh, the boat? Yeah. Good day. <laughs> Ciao. <laughs> you say you're taking a nap. Should have known. Should have known. <laughs> what is she ain't playing with a Girl, we added all our spots for the last time. No. Somebody yes. was in our spot for each one. All the nostalgia. Oh, and we found a restaurant that we love. We was like, um, hold on, let me. All right, y'all. Get him down. Oh, I know. Watch out. All right, y'all. I'm talking to the dog. Anyway, this is where we've been chilling at majority of the time when we home. <laughs> Ninety nine percent of the time, and this has been our view. Let me give y'all a quick shot out here on the terrace. It's been very relaxing, peaceful. It's cold. I know. We seen it start uh, raining while we was while we were eating. We was like, "Oh, please don't last." And then it kind of slowed down, stopped, and now started when we was headed home. I said, "All right, Delta, you want to get in the shot?" <laughs> Let me show them who I've been talking to. This is who I've been talking to over here. Oh, the little um, pergola up here over top. Let's see. Pergola with, some, with the tree wrapped around it. Such a good vibe, y'all. So pretty. <laughs>